This is O3's APV preferred maintenance. Okay, so for this example, we've got a P valve on the outside, blue neoprene is your dry suit, and on the inside here, we've got the internal tubing. For the maintenance and cleaning out, you want to remove the snap connector, which is usually already out or off of your kit anyway, so you've got no snap connector there. First of all, your P valve might be screwed down, or it might be uh, a little bit loose and open. Okay, so you want to take it into its sort of loose position, like so. Okay, you've then got two little holes which have got the nylon locking uh, wire that runs through it. What you're then going to do is go to your spares kit. Okay, that's got one of each item as a spares kit in there, but for the moment we just want the locking wire as a spare. What you then do is again making sure it is in that loose position, get the other bit of wire and push it through like so and remove the nylon locking wire. Once that's done, the dome will come off really nice and easily. Okay, like that. What's then exposed is this mushroom valve on the inside. Okay, this is a really key component. You want to make sure that this is clear from debris okay, at all times. So if you do ever have an issue, do go to this as the first point of check. Make sure there's no debris in between the mushroom valve and the valve itself. Okay, really easy to clean and maintain. It's got a little cap sort of section to it. You pop that off like so, comes off on an O-ring. You can take that off and again it exposes the valve for easy, ease of use for the maintenance. Always a good little trick to remember as well that customers have taught us is actually using a syringe with a, a mild disinfectant and sort of flush it through the tube and the valve itself. Uh, doing that with a little bit of sort of um, mild disinfectant, nice and friendly and with a little bit of warm water through there is absolutely perfect. Okay, that cleans out the valve, that cleans out the tubing. And then to reassemble, you go back to the mushroom valve again, making sure that it's nice and clear of debris. Pop it back into the valve itself, making sure it's all nice and pushed in. You then go back to the dome, reattach the dome. At this point, you want to screw it right down, okay, and then bring it back about a turn and a half, making sure that you've got, again, that nice little loose section to then re-thread the nylon wire back in on itself. And that goes in and it should sit nice and flush. Then you've got your closing section and your open section. There you go.